so um to start off i want to have the students go through an experience of multiple disciplines multiple competencies before they decide what degree and what major they will do right so flexible learning pathways is extremely important in my idea of an education institute for that matter what we do is um, like you had earlier called out the four degree types that we have which is btech bdes bsc and dba um we have five majors digital transformation uh, which involves everything related to business process transformation industrial automation uh then we have energy sciences which is related to generating power from earth's renewable energy which is wind solar and water um storing them ability to distribute them everything in that sphere of learning that's what we teach in energy sciences then there is interactive tech uh, how humans and computer interact with each other right voice based touch based keyboard interface ui ux gesture ar vr all of those things come under interactive technologies then we have mobility uh, which is uh, transportation modes using electric vehicles we are very conscious we are not going to talk about we are not going to um, teach about internal combustion engines everything that we do in mobility will be related to electric powered vehicles whether it is an electric power electric powered car unmanned aerial vehicle uh, mass transportation systems like a metro all of that will come under mobility and the fifth major is sustainable life sciences where a student will learn a lot about biotech um, some amount of sustainable agriculture model all of these that's what the students will learn across five of these modules we don't want the student to make a decision on what degree they're going to take when they join the university in the first 1 to 12 months everybody goes through a foundation set of courses we call them the explore phase of undergrad uh, here is where we are bringing students from various backgrounds students who have done physics chemistry maths students who have not done physics chemistry maths in their 11th and 12th uh, <coughs> students who focus focused on commerce or arts irrespective of what they focused on in 11th and 12th everybody goes through a basic set of foundation courses in year 1 the year one foundation courses will involve uh, a lot of emphasis on foundation in technology appreciation of differences uh, basic sciences uh, mathematics design thinking self awareness art appreciation critical thinking of uh, team work sense making financial appreciation uh, all of these things are what we call the foundation layers of an undergrad program um we get everybody to go through all of these and in addition there are five majors that we have we get students to go through real life project in each of the five majors in year 1 we put every student through a 3 week project actual real life implementation project in each of these majors after that we give the students 6 to 8 months to discover now what happens in discover phase is the student picks a multitude of courses from the wide array of courses that we provide student picks courses with the combination of degree type and major when i say degree type and major i'm saying a student can pick up a um, course that is primarily aligned to bdes in digital transformation or a bsc in energy sciences or a btech in interactive technology so the permutation combinations are all um, you know you can get a major in any one of the four degrees so student gets to pick different sets of projects across this combination um, in the discover phase which is month 13 to 21 by the end of discover phase we believe the student having spent 21 months of ug program is now having sufficient information to know what degree type and what major one wants to pursue that's when our next two phases kick in which is deep dive and experience where they go through the multitude of projects in the degree type and major they have selected um and in the final year they do a lot they do multitude of uh, capstone projects uh, more importantly from year 2 3 months of 
the calendar is set aside for industry projects as internships. So over a period of four years, a student at ATI University would have done nine months of internship, would have done over 30 actual projects, right? Um, in doing so, in doing so, the idea is for the student to be industry ready. The student has actually built a work portfolio, 